guys, so unfortunately the other day the youngest was walking through here, didn't realize the door was open and snapped it right off. So uh, in addition to shopping halls and weeks for dinner, we thought we'd show you a few things that need to happen around a house to keep, uh, keep everything flowing. Um, I don't know if you can see, but in this particular case right here, we've just got a, a nice clean crack. Uh, there's a couple areas where that got bent and it split out here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and take this off its hinges. Uh, and I'm going to take that outside. We're going to try to uh, clean it up a little bit, glue it, clamp it back together, see how it looks. If it's good, then we'll, uh, we'll keep this particular door, uh, and it'll just be a tiny expense for us. If it does not hold, then, uh, then we may have to look at getting a new door. So with that said, I'm going to go ahead and get this off the hinges and see what we can do. So step one, we need to find and fill all of our crack lines. The nice thing is these will seal up really well. So I'm going to just do a bead of glue in my cracks. up with a wet towel just these bead lines right here so I'll be right back that off and do the other side. Now we're just patient, we let it dry and see what we get. Alright guys, so this is our finished product. Um, I've taken it off the clamps and as you can see it is a nice clean 
uh, smooth look. Uh, of course, I took liberty while it was off the hinges to clean it up a little bit. Um, dust tends to accumulate in the edges, so I got all that cleaned up. Next step is I'm going to flip it over, put the hinges back on, and we'll reassemble it and check it out. All right, guys, so one cabinet door, very sturdy. Now we'll just hope nobody goes walking out that way again. Otherwise, I think we are good to go.